Hello and welcome back guys to our channel. So we almost complete our modern UI project tutorial. So on our previous videos, so we managed to do the functionality for create, refresh, edit, delete, and search. So now we will just add some validation to our customer form. Okay, so now let's start adding some validation to our customer form. So first, we need to modify our save. So we'll just move it to into a method. Private void save data. So the first thing that we need to add is to check if the data is valid. So the code first name and last name shouldn't be empty so private code is data valid code Let's check if first name F name so we get this there first name here is okay so we'll just check here if is data valid not valid then okay. so it will not continue to save the data if the code or first name or last name is empty okay let's try it out so let's create a new one save you can see code cannot be empty Yes. Yes. again. Last name can get so it's working. But I think I I put this wrong. Should be the second parameter is the message and the third is the type. Like that. Here. So the next validation that we need to check if the code already exists or the first name and last name already exist in our data so we will also not allow the user to save the information. Okay. Okay. So this data exists. 
Zero. So we will only do this validation if our function is created and table point rows point count table message. Add another validation to check for the name This checking should be handled in create new and edit. So we will check if we will check first if the table is not empty. So if they are the same, then return. checking first if the first name that we entered and the last name is has a value on our table then if it has then we will check if this row id is the existing one so we will check if we are just editing the data so if we are just editing so it will just be ignored okay i need to go this to lower to lower so now let's try so let's try edit first edit so we want to edit the middle name test fill table 
banyak kayak berpasal This time we don't have any error. Edit. Yes. Hey, it's working. So let's try to create a new one. Put this. First name is test two. Last name is test two. Save. zero this test two So that's how to debug. Wait again. So let the start to test 22. Now it works. So let's go down. Okay. So we just need to change our message since it's a so wrong message. Name already exists. Okay. So mostly our modern UI project is complete. So we managed to do the functionality for create, edit, delete, refresh, search and as well as the login and we added some basic validation for our data so hopefully you learn something from it and hopefully you can see you on my next video don't forget to click share subscribe and like to this channel thank you very much bye